a crime ridden area of Park Heights, where Spalding and Palmer come together. One, two, three, four, four shootings up here in the past month. A community is torn apart. A couple of days ago, right around there, somebody got shot on a pan yard, we call it. Police sitting around the corner, didn't catch him. So it seemed appropriate to set up our soapbox here. We wanted to find out what people here think local politicians need to do to address violence. Well, everybody need to come to the table and talk. It's just getting too bad out here. They worried about a Columbus Day statue, you feel me? My friend just got killed over here last night. It's been just over 48 hours since Donnell Black's friend was killed. Yeah, all they told us that he was dead and that was it. You can't say you from what you're working on helping the community, but your focus is on building a racetrack. Like, that's not helping our community. Across the street, a call for action. They, they, they don't address it. If I got caught carrying a gun, the best thing to do would be to get me off the streets. Because if I'm carrying a gun, that means I'm going to use it. The youngest person to give his opinion seemed to be the one who lacked the most hope. Gun violence is really bad, but I don't think it can be stopped because there's already too many guns in the city. My message to the politicians that's watching, don't just let us see commercials during election year. Half y'all politicians, we don't even know. I sit around people all day, they be, who's that, who's that, who's that? Strangers watching violence. How much bad do it really got to get for somebody to be like, well, enough is enough. Uh, thank you. In an area felt forgotten. Nothing's getting done in the hood. Joy LaPola, Fox 45 News.